So it's fielder five walking in steadily. They're off. And the grade one pin sent Mason is manifesto. Lovitz is chase and Western Warhorse has jumped off without any problems at all in the pearl blue and indeed just about led them over the first from Hooks is Andre. And then Fox Abiel in third, dodging bullets, red cap is out wide, and Oscar Whiskey in the hoop sleeves are the favourite held out last of the quintet. So on to fence two they go. A Western Warhorse just ahead of Hooks Andre. And then Fox Appeal racing enthusiastically in the very early part of the race, throwing his head around a little. Uh, the first of the ditches, Western Warhorse jumped well. Hooks is Andre a careful in second. And then Fox Appeal, shadowed by Dodging Bullets and Oscar Whiskey, uh, looking on. So the last fence in the back straight, first time. And Western Warhorse safely to the other side has extended his advantage to uh, some four lengths and over the chasing quartet, who are headed by Hooks is Andre in the hands of the 18 times champion. Uh, Fox Appeal and Aidan Coleman, White Jacket in third, and then Dodging Bullet, Sam Twist and Davis, the Green Sleeves, and Oscar Whiskey and Barry Geraghty at just last as they travel along the side of the course and onto the fifth. So Western Warhorse safely over it, Dodging Bullets uh, just a little bit unsighted behind Fox Appeal, who tickle the top, and Western Warhorse uh, leads them into the home straight first time. The Arkle winner, tracked by Hooks is Andre, Runner up at the Cheltenham Festival, went down fighting there. A Fox Appeal, Skip Cheltenham to come straight here to Aintree. And then Oscar Whiskey and Dodging Bullets and Uxis Andre uh, took over at fence six, jumping left. And perhaps wisely, Tom Scudamore switches Western Warhorse uh, to the other side of Uxis Andre as they move towards another ditch. Uxis Andre a bit straighter there. Western Warhorse had to put himself right. And the other three close up, Dodging Bullets to switch to the inner. Fox Appeal in fourth, and then Oscar Whiskey. So on to uh, Fence 8. To finish them off after a further circuit in this Grade 1 contest. And Uxis Andre chasing a third win over fences, leading from Western Warhorse. Uxis Andre jumped really well there. McCoy made up his mind for him, and he delivered with a quick and accurate leap. Western Warhorse tracks him under the judge. Dodging Bullets in third, and then Fox Appeal on the outer of Oscar Whiskey. So left-handed they go, back towards the far side. Further eight fences to jump in this Pin St. Mason's Manifesto Novices Chase. Hooks is Andre. By a couple of lengths from Western Warhorse in the hands of Tom Scudamore. Dodging bullets and Fox Appeal next. And still Garrity sits and waits aboard Oscar Whiskey, the dual entry hurdle winner. He's in a fourth win over fences and some compensation for his early exit at the festival. Hooks is Andre and Western Warhorse at the ninth. Little splitting the pair. Fox Appeal uh, was in tight there and he just grubbed the ground with his nose. And Oscar Whiskey and Dodging Bullets move around him on towards the next on the far side. Hooks is Andre and Western Warhorse with the pace quickening all the time. Little to choose again between the leading pair and a line of three in behind. Dodging Bullets closest to the rail. Oscar Whiskey wide and Fox Appeal between them. And now another open ditch. Fence 11. Hooks is Andre by a whisker from Western Warhorse. Horse. About four lengths clear from Dodging Bullets, Fox Appeal briefly hustled along, and Garrity still sits quietly aboard Oscar Whiskey. Last on the far side, and there Oscar Whiskey jumped out to his right, and he was a bit untidy, and had to be chased for three or four strides, quickly back in touch as Hooks' Andre Western Warhorse lead them down the side of the course. Still around about four lengths clear from Dodging Bullets, and the driven along Fox Appeal, and now three lengths to Oscar Whiskey, and he's just having to be nudged along by Garrity to try and get on terms as they draw towards the fourth last. Hooks is Andre just ahead from Western Warhorse. Dodging bullets, a mistake when chasing the leading pair. Fox Appeal is next, and it's hard work for Oscar Whiskey as they round the corner. And Hooks is Andre and Western Warhorse, at this stage at least, are, are beginning to break loose. They've gone five lengths clear from Fox Appeal. Dodging bullets, hard at work in fourth, receiving reminders. And then Oscar Whiskey. So closing in on the third last. Hooks is Andre just ahead once again from Western Warhorse with Scooter gathering him up for another crack. McCoy now crouching a little lower on Uxis Andre, approaching the second half. Oscar Whiskey beginning to stay on, has moved into third. Uxis Andre over the penultimate fence, about five lengths clear, but Oscar Whiskey is now out after him, moves into second. Western Warhorse, the Arkle winner beaten, 
Oh, says Andre. Oscar Whiskey closing now. Eroding the deficit. Still 100 yards off the final fence. Oh, says Andre. Oscar Whiskey has reduced the margin to three lengths. And he's still closing. Oh, says Andre at the last. Got over it safely. Oscar Whiskey only two lengths down. Now the dash to the line. Put boy in full flight on Oaks's Andre. Garrity trying to reach the gap on Oscar Whiskey. But Oaks's Andre is doing it off and has his day in the sun. And it's Oaks's Andre who wins the grade one manifesto novices chase. The champion manners, Alan King, and the 18 times champion, Oscar Whiskey second. Close third, Fox Appeal of Western Warhorse. First, number four, Oxy's Andre. Second, number three. Third, number five. And fourth, number two. The full result to our sixth race of the day, the Pinson Mason's Manifesto Novice Steeplechase. First, number four, Oxy's Andre. Second, number three, Oscar Whiskey. Third, number five, Western Warhorse. And the fourth placed horse, number two, Fox Appeal.